so as I said last month I would come back for a second period vlog I did start my period yesterday two days early it didn't take me by surprise again so that was really good the first thing I did was put on some of my uh, salt wear underwear so I bought myself a three pack, a bundle. So I got this lilac one, which hasn't been used, but because of the black inside, it kind of looks like it's stained in the crotch. But I haven't used these yet. And I got another pair of black in that bundle and I got a pair of blue that I'm wearing right now. Um, I will show you in a minute, I guess. Um, I wore the black ones that they'd sent me uh, last month, yesterday, and they were great. I actually was really surprised. I really gave them a workout as well. Because my period had just started, I decided to do a dance with TikTok, um, did all that in there. And after all that dancing, my period had come on quite heavy. You could barely even really see it because it's got black lining, but you could see like, TMI for anyone, we are talking periods here. Um, you could see liquid, like a little bit of blood on the top, but I knew I'd bled more than that. And I could f not feel it on the knickers, but like... I don't know how to explain it, but I knew there was a lot more in there, but I wasn't feeling wet or anything like that. Um, if I felt the front of the knickers, I could feel it was like warm, but nothing came through onto my hands. I was worried because I could kind of feel that like, you know, I'm having a period into my knickers and I would touch the front and no blood would come off my fingers. So they're, they're doing a really, really good job. Excuse me if you can hear my girls laughing in the other room. So they're doing a really good job. So then I wore them for about... I don't know, nine, ten hours, and then I had a bath, and uh, I put in my Ziggy Cup. So this is the Ziggy Cup 1, not the Ziggy Cup 2. I found it fairly easy to put in. It wasn't too hard. You have to put them in slightly different from the cups. Once I've cleaned it, I will show you. I'm not wearing it right now. I'll explain why. But um, you kind of squeeze it into a hot dog, put it in, and you put it past your cervix, and then you kind of push it up so it kind of hooks in. It's a weird... Thing, but you can't feel it in your vaginal canal like you can the cups i couldn't feel it at all honestly but it did work it did work really well like i will say that um i put it in overnight put on a new pair of undies there was no leaks this morning so um the ziggy cup or the the knickers were working there was a little bit of blood in the knickers but like a really small amount and i could tell that the knickers weren't full at all it was just like a i guess whatever was in my vaginal canal that had come out into the into the knickers the ziggy cups seem to work really really well so this morning when i went to the toilet i heard that they are kind of self-emptying once you start to urinate or defecate um the cup will move slightly or the disc will move slightly and start slowly emptying which i did find that happened but i also uh wanted to take it out give it a wash have a look because i hadn't used the disc before taking it out is the problem <laughs> i'm gonna put some tmi photos there will be blood um i'll try and blur it a bit just so you can kind of see the level of mess because when i've used the cups really there isn't any mess at all if it may be a tiny bit on your tip of your finger but this was a different story i've heard people call them blood drawers before and that's actually quite a good description i would say once you get your finger because you because they're so deep in there you kind of have to get your finger right up and you have to hook it and put it down so it's not being held in like the cup so it kind of pours out so immediately i felt it kind of just go all over my hand and it was just awful it was horrifying for me so i'm like this is a big note for me so i don't know if it's purely because i'm kind of new and maybe there's a better method maybe doing it in the shower would be better it wouldn't be so horrifying maybe but for me right now i don't think i'm ready for a disc um I'm not planning on having any uh, sex, although I did figure out a way that I could kind of test that, but um, not really. So I'm thinking I'm not going to do that. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to take a pass on the disc for now. I do intend to come back to it, but as this is my last month before I go away, I want to really practice with my cups, make sure I get them down. Looking at when my next period should happen, it should happen actually while I'm away doing my skate uh rollout so the big rollout that's happening i should be on my period during that so at first when i realized that i got a bit worried but then after using the knickers last night i realized that this is not going to be a problem at all i'm going to just wear a pair of knickers on that day and a menstrual cup and i am completely confident that there's going to be no problems whatsoever even if the cup failed the knickers are going to do me good so i'm not worried at all i'm actually kind of excited to give it a really good 
test run like that because obviously you, you, I think you do bleed more when you exercise as well so I'm really excited to try that out so on a whole the Ziggy Cup worked it's just really really messy to get out like and I wasn't down for that yet like I'm just not there yet the salt wear knickers are fantastic and I would really recommend these I kind of wish I would bought just a few more actually just because you know either side of the end of your period you can get like just a little bit and I kind of thought well four is enough for every day of the period but um I think really six I might would I'd like to have six but I do have those cheap Primark ones so I'm thinking I'll just use those on the days just a couple of days afterwards so um for now I'm going to leave this here and I'll let you know how I get on with my cups that I'm going to continue using for the rest of this month for now I actually have nothing in I am just using my salt wear knickers and I'll show you those as well so you can see my undies right now so treat <laughs> okay so these are the blue salt wear uh, undies they feel so soft i like whenever i have to touch these knickers i end up stroking myself they're really really soft they're lovely but um yeah these are the boy short i think these are the overnight i bought all overnight ones so i thought why buy light flow ones i'd rather just buy heavy flow ones all the time and never have to worry so this is them they're really comfy these fit really well these are a size small so i got the medium in the ones that were sent to me and i said i think i could go a little bit smaller even though they fit me fine and these are the small and they fit me perfect so yeah and this is the color really <laughs> to show you but yeah i have no worries about using these knickers at all so i will just keep getting back to you on my progress with getting used to the cups i guess i'm going to try the intermina ones today i'm going to bath in a little bit and i'm going to put an intermina cup in so far from my holiday i have actually packed the salt cups because i've had the most success with those right now but if i can get the intermina ones working for me this month i'll probably take those with me instead because they have the little travel cases which are just so convenient so yeah i'll see you in a bit bye okay so yesterday i was using the uh blue knickers all day they worked fine there was no overall leaks however towards the end of the day i did notice on the like the liner underneath there's a little bit of red just beside that so i think if i wore them for much longer they may have got to a point of leaking but i don't think so because this is like all day and it was just a tiny little bit of staining to the side and this was also on my heaviest day so i think they did really 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 well and i'm super happy with them i then had a bath and put in the lily cup one and it was really easy to get in this time i found it much easier there was creases in it i did the troubleshooting where you run your finger around that fixed it just fine um, overnight i woke up and i noticed that when i went to the toilet there was more blood coming out so i think the cup wasn't sitting completely correctly so i'm still having a bit of issues trying to get used to the lily cups so they are a bit smaller than the salt cups but it wasn't full it was nowhere near full and there was no leaks into the knickers that i put on the fresh pair of um salt knickers the salt wear ones so it did a good job i'm still feeling extremely confident about this holiday now because i feel combining with the cups with the salt wear i just don't really have anything to worry about now so even if i leak out my cup i know my knickers are gonna catch anything that's left so yeah so far, so good. <laughs> this was at the end of the third day, <clears throat> excuse me, and I hadn't been wearing a cup or a disc, and eventually I did start to leak out onto the underside of the knickers, but it hadn't got onto any of my clothes, so still I feel it was good. Okay, so my period is now over. It actually finished like yesterday, but throughout part of today i've had like just like a little bit so i've continued using the salt wear yesterday i used the leak up one again and it did leak and there was one point when after i got out the bath i put it back in and then i sat on the bed for a little while and didn't put my salt wear on and i did actually leak out onto my bed so i haven't had the best luck with my intermina cups so as it stands i'm going to take my salt cups with me to america along with my salt wear and when i come back i'll be trying the intermina cups again because i really want to get use out of all of the stuff i have and they might be really easy so i think it's just a learning curve i think i'm just not very good at these ones but if you use intermina let me know and if you had like 
any problems if it had a learning curve for you or like if you have no problems and like what you do because I don't know what I'm doing wrong <laughs> but yeah that's everything really so yeah I guess I'll see you next month <laughs> bye <laughs>